our next very worst job takes us to Paris, and deep into its bowels lurks a man more underground than the intellectuals of the left bank. Sifting through the muck and goo of the chic and the fancy, he provides a service that's unheard of anywhere else. If a Parisian drops a ring in the toilet or some keys into the gutter, then they know who to call. These guys, the sewer detectives. Here's one descending into miles of cack to recover somebody's car keys last seen disappearing down a drain on the Boulevard de Sebastopol. It's a free service offered by the council and one of the worst jobs ever dreamt up. Every day it's like an adventure. We never know what we're going to find in the sewage. Despite the lack of natural light and the stench of human effluent, navigation in the sewers is remarkably easy. There are signs that indicate the name of the street and the building numbers are also the same as outside of the sewers. But the obvious downside of the job is, of course, the smell. Marriage is hard enough without bringing home the stubborn brown mist of labour in the sewer. Every day we take showers after work and that's what helps us get rid of this bad smell. And it's true to say that one of the most important things in the life of a sewer detective is to look after his hygiene. That way, when we get home, our women won't smell the stench of sewage on us. The retirement age for a sewer detective is 50. And Philippe is looking forward to spending less time with the kids at the pool and more time with his kids at home. But he'd better make the most of it. The life expectancy for these men is 10 years less than average. The fact that we are walking in the excrement for all these years and inhaling all these odours and gases like hydrogen sulphide, it's all these that cause damage not only to our lungs but to our stomachs, brains and whole bodies, really. All that aside, with a 70% success rate, he can be secure in the knowledge that he's done a good job. And after an hour's search, the lost keys have been found. It's time for the sewer detectives to trudge onwards through the scat in search of that gold-plated turd that shines at the end of every tunnel.